Now, the next piece you're going to do is uh, by a North Carolinian, James Taylor. That's right. Known best for Fire and Rain and Sweet Baby James and a Handyman. But you're going to do a deep cut. It's, some people know this song, like me, but I think a lot of people do not know this song. All right. Now, did you hear James Taylor in concert ever? Yeah, uh, when I was a sophomore, uh, maybe a junior in college, we went to see him in Johnson City. And a funny story about that, toward the end of the concert, I went with a bunch of fraternity brothers. And I was with one guy and Richard. He says, I'm gonna go down to the stage. I said, Richard, that's crazy. You're not gonna go down to the stage. So he gets up, leaves the seat, goes down, because it was the encore. Mm -hmm. So anyway, he goes down to the stage, gets backstage, and I mean, Freedom Hall in Johnson City sat about 7,500 people. Mm -hmm. So, but, and it was packed out. And Richard gets back, James Taylor comes off the stage and Rich, Richard is back there giving him high fives and doing all sorts of stuff. Somehow he got back there. <laughs> so that was a great story. Then years, fast forward years later, uh, Anna Beth for, I guess it was for my birthday, got us tickets to see him in Columbia. Mm -hmm. And by that time, of course, his kid, Ben, mm -hmm. is his son and mm -hmm. he was with him and he was playing in the band. And of course, by that time, more of James's career was behind him than mm -hmm. was ahead of him. Mm -hmm. And he played all of the, you know, all of his songs, all of his hits. And uh, uh, I have, uh, I'm, I'm babbling too much that's now. Not, that's not um, when I first heard James Taylor, my sister was a big fan when I was a teenager and I didn't like him. Mm -hmm. I thought he was too nasally in the way that he sang. Mm -hmm. And after I listened to it for a while, I thought, you know what? I can play this stuff. Mm -hmm. And so I listened to his albums and I learned to play most of his. Now he has some songs that I cannot play. Mm -hmm. um, the faster ones, mostly. Um, Steamroller Blues? Well, I can play that one. <laughs> but, uh, but there's one, Smiling Face, yeah. I can't play that song. It's too fast. And I'm, I, I play slower. A little uh, bit of a picker. Yeah, I'm more of a, well, he's a picker. Yeah. I mean, he's a great guitar player. But, uh, but anyway, yeah, this song um, um, never made it to mainstream. You might hear it on some of the FM channels. Uh, but he didn't ever make a hit with this song. Yeah. And I saw James Taylor in concert in Tuscaloosa, Alabama for Homecoming one year. Uh, again, a lot of his career was already behind him. I like a mature artist like that. I think that when they are uh, got their career at that point, they know that the fans show up for the hits. Right. And so they don't waste your time with things that you don't want to hear. Right. And, uh, and I follow him on Instagram, and I find him to be one of the more refreshing people I follow on Instagram because he sometimes will post retro pictures from uh, him and Carol King or him and Carly Simon the, the other days, the previous days. And then sometimes it's him and his dog going for walks in the woods. But this is called The Secret of Life is Enjoying the Passing of Time. It was on the JT album, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, yep. <laughs> No. 
us a smile, isn't it a lovely ride? I'll be sliding down, gliding down, try not to try too hard, it's just a lovely ride. The thing about time is that time isn't Just your point of view. How does it feel for you? Einstein said he could never understand it all. Planets are spinning through space. That smile upon your face. Welcome to the human race, isn't it a lovely ride? We'll be sliding down, gliding down, try not to try too hard, it's just a lovely ride. Isn't it a lovely ride? I'll be sliding down. Try not.